Okay, so here is a problem today, really interesting and tricky problem that try to stun the internet nowadays. This is viral problem, so we are going to solve it. We are going to solve it correctly and step by step with my explanation. So in this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you are going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So I don't want you to use your calculator right here and of course here is a problem. 4 divided by 2 and in parentheses 1 plus 1. As you can see no squares, no cubes, no like uh, interesting, interesting moments right here, fractions, so only 4 to one division addition and multiplication so right now i suggest you to choose one option what do you think is a correct answer to this problem so one four or two it will be really interesting to check my answer in like 30 seconds and i'm going to show you a correct answer here in just one minute and we will check our answer it will be really interesting Okay, so here is our problem. I just wanted to rewrite it. 4 divided by 2 and in parentheses 1 plus 1. Okay, so one part of students start with division. Yeah, they say, okay, let's divide it first. Second part of students start with, okay, let's multiply it first right here in the middle. And the third step, the third part of students try to get the parentheses answer. They start with this parentheses. So as you can see, three combination of solution. First part of students start to divide, then multiply, then parentheses, and a lot of combination. And obviously, whatever order we select is going to create a different answer, right? One, two, or four, as you can see. And right here we have order of operation because obviously whatever order we select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem, yeah? Okay, so right here we have PMDMC order, the main popular order in the world, all internet libraries, all scientific graph and calculator works according to PMDMC order, okay? So let's start with this PMDMC order. What is the first step? Because PMDMC works from the top to the bottom, yeah? And right here I separate this part, we have 4 divided by 2 and in parentheses 1 plus 1, okay? Okay, so the first step according to PMDMC is parentheses, yeah? So, really good, because we start with this parentheses, 1 plus 1 equal to 2, and in the beginning we, we have like that, 4 divided by 2 and times 2, okay? Okay. What is the next step? Exponents. Are there any exponents, squares, cubes right here? No, I don't see any of those. Let's go next. Multiplication. Okay, really interesting. We need to start from this multiplication or not, yeah? But right here we have division and this is a main mistake right here because a lot of students say, okay, the next step is multiplication. They multiply 4 divided by 4 equal to 1 and they say, okay, this is the answer. But right here we have multiplication and division part as one group. And this is really interesting and tricky moment because we need to scan. Are there any division and multiplication sign? Yeah, we have division and multiplication. This is our case. And now we need to understand what is the correct order. For this question, we need to scan what is the first sign from left to right. The first sign from left to right, this is division, yeah? So we need to divide it first. Doesn't matter. Multiplication, division, the first sign from left to right. So we have like 4 divided by 2 equal to 2 and 2 times 2 equal to equal to 4. And this is our answer according to PMDMC order. Of course, you can easily plug in into, into your calculator this problem and you can easily check this answer in Wolfram Alpha, you can easily check this answer. Of course, a lot of countries, a lot of discussion about this problem, a lot of countries have different order of operation and it is really great, I think. A lot of countries, a lot of discussion, a lot of views on YouTube about it and you, we can easily discuss, we can easily discuss about this question. So write your option in a comment. What do you think is a correct answer? What do you think is a correct order of operation? It will, it will be really interesting to read about it. I definitely wish all the best in your mathematics adventures. Thank you for your time and have a great day. See you in the next videos.